All of ASEAN football is behind Vietnam's AFC U23 challenge. Fox Sports Asia football editor Gabriel Tan believes that the whole of Southeast Asia will be supporting Vietnam as they continue their improbable run at the 2018 AFC U23 championship. Whilst not a betting man, I can only imagine what the pre-tournament odds were on Vietnam reaching the semi-finals of the 2018 AFC U23 championship. Two weeks and 32 matches into the tournament, there are now four challengers remaining. Korea Republic, Qatar, Uzbekistan and Vietnam. Yes, Vietnam. The same Vietnam who have qualified for the AFC Asian Cup just once in the last 14 editions, and as CO hosts at that. The same Vietnam who, even on the regional stage, have won the ASEAN Football Federation Championship presently known as the Suzuki Cup, just once in ten attempts. There is no doubting that Vietnamese are a proud footballing people who are fiercely competitive every time they take to the field but, at a continental level, few would argue that they are presently anything more than a mid-level team. Which makes it all the more impressive that Vietnam with a squad averaging 20.7 years of age is are already one of Asia's top four teams at this year's AFC U23 Championship. That's younger than Korea Republic, 21.4 years average, and Uzbekistan, 20.9 years average, although it is Qatar, 19.3 years average, who can lay claim to being the most youthful of the semi-finalists. Even by making it out of the group stage, the Vietnamese along with fellow quarter-finalist Malaysia have already done enough to make ASEAN football very proud. And following the brave Malaysians' unfortunate elimination at the hands of the South Koreans, Vietnam remains Southeast Asia's last hope of a stunning success in China. For that, Park Hang Seo and his charges deserve the support of an entire region. And, chances are, their neighbors will not disappoint. Even in Saturday's quarter-final victory over Iraq on penalties following a 3-3 extra-time draw social media was awash with an outpouring of support for the Vietnamese many of which were from Malaysian fans who, mere hours before, had seen their own side fall to a heartbreaking defeat to the South Koreans. Southeast Asia has always been a curious region when it comes to football. When it comes to tournaments like the AF Suzuki Cup and Southeast Asian Games, the unbridled passion for one's team leads to a rivalry so intense to the point that there can be genuine disdain for one another in the moment. But only in the moment. Past events have shown that, in an event like what we are currently witnessing at the AFC U23 Championship, that same passion is extended to any neighboring country in support of the greater good that is the betterment of ASEAN football as a whole. It cannot be denied that Vietnam's superb run to the semi-finals has come as a huge boost for Southeast Asia. When they take on Qatar in Changzhou on Tuesday afternoon, it is the duty of every fan from Cambodia to Timor-Leste to be rooting for the Vietnamese. And, Despite my previously stated lack of interest in gambling, I'm willing to bet the whole of Southeast Asia will indeed be cheering them on.